Never knew how much I loved you. Never knew how much I cared. But when you put your arms around me, I get a fever that's so hard to bear. You give me fever. When you kiss me, fever when you hold me tight. Fever in the morning, fever all through the night. Sun lights up the daytime, a moon lights up the night. I light up when you call my name. I know you're gonna treat me right. You give me fever. When you kiss me, fever when you hold me tight. Fever in the morning, a fever all through the night. Everybody's got the fever. That is something you all know. Fever isn't such a new thing. Fever started long ago. Captain Smith and Pocahontas I had a very mad affair. When her daddy tried to kill him, she said, Daddy, oh, don't you dare. He gives me fever. When he kisses, fever when he holds me tight. Fever, I'm his missus. Dad, I want you to treat him right. Now you've listened to my story. Here's the point that I have made. The chicks are gonna give you fever, be it Fahrenheit or sin, a great day give you fever. When you kiss them, a fever if you live and learn, a fever till you sizzle. But what a lovely way to burn. What a crazy way to burn. What a crazy way to burn. Oh, it's so hot. <laughs> oh, thank you. Good evening, and thank you so much for that warm welcome. I've heard about Southern hospitality, but tonight I believe in Southern hospitality because of you folks right here in Greenville, South Carolina. Everybody comes from somewhere. I come from the cold. The cold plains of Jamestown, North Dakota. I was the seventh of eight children. Mama died when I was four. And when Daddy remarried, my life was forever changed. My stepmother, Minnie, used to thrust my hands in boiling water when I was washing the dishes. She would step on my fingers as I scrubbed the floor on my hands and knees. She told me I couldn't sing very well and she forbade me to sing at the Methodist Church or the PTA meetings. Yes, I come from the cold, but I had within me a fever. You see, I could sing before I could talk. Oh, I remember I was about 14 years old. My best friend said to me, what are you going to be when you grow up? And I said, well, I'm going to sing with a band. I'm going to travel. I'm going to be famous. I already knew singing was my ticket out of this godforsaken life. Thank goodness the town people took care of me. They made sure I had rides to all my gigs with the bands and at the radio stations. Then finally, finally, my break came. Benny Goodman was looking to replace Helen Forrest, and I was his pick. The first song I got to record with Benny was, Why Don't You Do Right? Remember that one? Why don't you do right like some other men do? 
Did you know that sold over a million copies? It was the biggest hit ever. I only got to stay with Benny two years. He had his rules. There was to be no canoodling amongst the band members. That was grounds for dismissal. So when I fell in love with Dave Barber and we got married, it was Splitsville from the band. But in that two years, I had learned discipline, timing, to pay attention to details. And I had positioned myself as a force to be reckoned with, an unusual position for a woman in that day and time. I was always, always pushing the envelope, looking for new material. And after I studied songwriting with that very talented, prolific songwriter, Johnny Mercer, I wrote some pretty good ones with my husband, Dave Barber. It's a good day. Manana. I love being here with you. I don't know enough about you. Oh, but Capitol Records did not always approve of my choices. Sometimes I had to wait for my bargaining chip. I remember when Lieber and Stoller sent a song over to me one afternoon. I listened to it, and I wasn't sure at first that I liked it at all. It was odd. But I picked that needle up, and I played that 45 over and over and over again. Loving it a little bit more each time. Feeling it a little bit more each time. <laughs> but Capitol Records said, it's too long. No radio station will play it. It's too much of a downer. No one will listen to it. It's too esoteric. No one will buy it. So I waited. And when CBS told Capitol Records they wanted Peggy Lee to do a special, I saw my opening. So I tell you, my friends, because I tell you everything, that's not all there is to that story. You see, Capitol Records had made their decision, but what they hadn't counted on was so had I. Is that all there is? Is that all there is? If that's all there is, my friends, then let's keep dancing. Bring out the booze and have a ball. If that's all there is. Aw, uh, you didn't think I was going to leave you on that down note, did you? Tonight is my night out for dancing There's a guy that I'm romancing I hope he falls for me before the night is through I can't wait till they start swaying What the heck is that they're playing? I caramba, it's the samba It's the one dance I can't do You better play a room before me Cause I know he will adore me When I begin to do a room boucher or two. I am waiting on the floor now, just another minute more now. Caramba, it's the samba, it's the one dance I can't do. When 
when they play something dreamy you will see me waltz away from everyone and when i tango all the gang go off the floor to watch the fun ah there must be a million of the tunes that aren't brazilian so i don't understand why they don't play a few of the bands about to start now there'll be music in my heart now Calamba, it's the samba the one dance i can't do away from everyone and when i tango all the gang go off the floor to watch the fun ah, there must be a million of the tunes that are brazilian so i don't understand why they don't play a few all the bands about to start now there'll be music in my heart now caramba the samba The one dance I can